NAEYC has created its own portfolio templates, which can be accessed at the link shown below. These templates contain instructions for use in the first few slides. Start by downloading the templates from the NAEYC website and saving them on your computer. Ensure your portfolios are contained in one central location and clearly labeled. In this video, you can see me moving my portfolio template files into folders to keep them organized. Rename your portfolios using the guide shown below. You will only need one shared portfolio for each age group. For example, if you have three preschool-aged classrooms, your center should submit one shared preschool portfolio for all three of those classrooms. Backing up your documents online is recommended in the event that your computer crashes. A program like Google Drive Backup and Sync can be set up to automatically back up your files as long as you're connected to the internet. It is free to use as long as you have a Gmail account. If you don't have an account, it's free to create one by going to gmail.com and following the prompts to create an account. Once you have an account, go to the URL shown above. You will want Google Backup and Sync for individuals. Download this file and follow the prompts to install it. Your installation prompts might look different from mine if you use a Windows computer. Once installed, open the program and log in to your Gmail account. The program will now show you a page like this. Deselect all of these folders. You will only want the program to back up your portfolio files. Click Choose Folder and select the folder containing your portfolios on your computer. Once selected, you will see the folder checked. Make sure you select Original Quality. Click Next. On the next page, select Sync Everything in My Drive. This will copy any files uploaded to your Google Drive online to your folder on your computer. Now you have successfully backed up your portfolios. Let's return to Google Drive Online. You will see all of your files backed up under My Computer as shown here. When adding evidence to your portfolios, you will often need to import scanned documents to present as evidence. Microsoft Word does not have the capability to import PDF files into documents. That is why it's recommended to scan your documents as image files rather than PDFs. Here I'll demonstrate how to scan files and save them as images. When scanning a document, open the Printer Utility app and select JPEG as your file format. If you're scanning a multi-page document, this will save each scanned page as an individual JPEG file. Once scanned, open your portfolio template and select Insert, then Picture from File. You can select one or multiple pictures to add to your document at once. Now that your scanned evidence is imported into your document, you can modify it by clicking on the image, 
going to the picture format menu and rotating, cropping, or resizing as necessary. Thank you for watching this video. If you have any questions about the technical aspects of constructing your portfolios, please send an email to accreditation.information at naeyc.org.